Learning CPR can save a life, but most Texans don't know how to help someone during an emergency. That's why KXAN and the American Heart Association are teaming up to offer free CPR classes. Our Sally Hernandez shows us how some folks stepped up today to learn how to take matters into their own hands. Yes, 70 percent of cardiac arrests happen in homes. So if you are called upon to give CPR, you want to make sure you know how to do it because most likely you will be saving a life. And that's what this event is all about today. Rain or shine, definitely rainy and windy out there, but that's not stopping people from coming in and learning how to do CPR, including some workers over at uh, Texas Mutual Insurance. So we have joining us Rachel Pollack, who helped put together um, an email that went out to volunteers over at your work and saying, come on down. Why did you decide to do it? Um, our company does workers' compensation insurance, so safety is a huge, um, important value to our company, and I think it uh, made a big impact on employees, so it was really easy for people to get to come. They, they were really, like, enthusiastic about it, so. And, and that's what I was going to ask you. I mean, how difficult was it get, to get people to sign up? Because they got out here and learned CPR really fast yeah. uh, and it was it's rainy and it's windy so was it easy to get them out here um, it was actually a lot easier than I thought it would be they everyone was really interested I got a lot of questions a lot of like uh, people were really intrigued and like I said people really value safety so I think that was the the really factor that hit home most for our company and Rachel what do you hope that they walk away with later on today mostly I hope they walk away with confidence so if they do see someone that is going into cardiac arrest or needs CPR that they'll have the confidence to go volunteer to get in there and do it and did you did you learn something today I definitely did yeah I definitely learned I wasn't pressing hard enough <laughs> yeah so definitely something that you would encourage other people to learn oh for sure yes I think it's a great skill to know all right Rachel thank you so much for joining us and thanks for getting the word out there to your employees as well just a reminder cardiac arrest is the leading cause of death each year more than 350 thousand out of hospital cardiac arrests happen right here in the United States so we are definitely training people to save lives back to you I love it thanks so much Sally and you can participate in your own hands-on CPR training session this Saturday mark your calendar just come on out to the Long Center for the American Heart Association's annual heart walk registration starts at 7 in the morning and the event kicks off at 8 along with the 5k runner walk there will also be instructors who can teach you how to perform CPR could be a brisk walk but hey you got to warm yeah. up somehow and it is a workout um, Sally was saying and Rachel was telling her she was surprised how much pressure you have to put down and you're doing it if you're on the phone with a 911 dispatcher you might be doing it for a while yeah. so it's going to warm you up fast absolutely <laughs> we're going to need all the warmth that we can get Erin just mm -hmm.